these stern landing vessels are being already designed and being built for fitment of MMRs when they become commercially available in 2028. This will allow the 70-meter SLV and the 90-meter SLV to transit from Hawaii to Guam. Guam to Okinawa. Okinawa to Manila. Manila to Singapore. Singapore to Darwin. Darwin to Cairns. Cairns to Fiji. Fiji to American Samoa. And then American Samoa to Hawaii. This 14,717 nautical mile round trip would take 44 days, steaming at 14 knots and allowing 50% port time, 26 days in total, 3.5 days at each port, including the departure port, would take 75 days for the tour. Fitted with MMRs, this would allow 48 tours to be carried out before refueling the MMRs. At each port, the 90-hour stopover would allow ship to shore electrical power transfer up to 360 megawatt hours. Sea Transport builds these SLVs through licensed shipyards in Europe, Asia, the Pacific and the US. The 50, 70 and 90 meter SLVs are suitable for military activities. Sea Transport, bold initiatives in ship design and operation for remote areas using MMRs.